What if you could retire early and replace your full-time income with dividend checks rolling in from your investments? Sounds too good to be true? Believe it or not, thousands achieve financial freedom every year thanks to the power of compounding dividend growth stocks and funds. Hello and welcome back to WWL. Today we're talking about the fastest way you can realistically start living off dividends to the tune of $3,200 per month. That's right, $3,200 of passive income coming in every month just from your investments without having to lift a finger. Pretty sweet deal, right? Now, when we talk about living off dividends, we simply mean generating enough dividend income from stocks and funds you own that it replaces your regular salary. It lets you cover your monthly expenses without having to work a 9-to-5 job. Living off dividends usually takes big upfront investments and decades of time for the dividends to compound. But today, we'll show you how with the right strategy, you can shorten that timeline significantly. With some focus and discipline, it is possible to generate $3,200 in monthly dividend income within just a few years. Excited? We sure are. But before we dive into the fastest ways to live off dividends, let's go over a quick Dividends 101 crash course so we're all on the same page. So what exactly are dividends? Simply put, dividends are a portion of a company's profits that get paid out to their shareholders. Yeah, you heard that right. By owning shares of a company, you can get paid just for being a part owner. Here's a quick example. Say you own shares of Wonder Widget Inc., they make a million dollars in profit in one year. Their board decides to pay out $200,000 of those profits back to shareholders in the form of dividends. Since you own 0.5% of the company's shares, you get sent a nice little dividend check for $1,000. The amount you get paid per share is called the dividend yield. Some companies pay high dividend yields, over 5 to 6%, while other growth companies focus their spare cash on expanding instead of paying dividends. But more on how to pick the best dividend stocks later. Dividends get even better when companies pay them consistently and increase the amount over time. These stalwarts are called dividend aristocrats, and they're the creme de la creme for dividend seekers like us. We'll definitely be talking more about how to identify them soon. For now, just remember that dividends are basically cash bonus payments that companies pay out to us shareholders. So buying shares of companies focused on paying rising dividends can generate very nice passive income streams in your investment portfolio. The more shares you own, the higher those quarterly dividend checks get. Living off dividends, how much do you need? All right, now for the fun part. Let's dive into how you could strategically build an investment portfolio that generates enough dividend income to cover your living expenses. Wouldn't that be incredible? Retiring early to travel the world, all funded by your dividend stock portfolio. The amount of dividend income you'll need to replace your paychecks obviously depends on what your lifestyle costs are. But you're in luck because we'll show you the exact step-by-step -step formula. On average, Americans spend around $60,000 per year on living expenses, according to Bureau of Labor Statistics. But your personal number is likely different, based on factors like house or rent costs, healthcare expenses, debt payments, kids or family members to support, and how much travel, entertainment, etc. you want. So take out a piece of paper and jot down your own approximate annual spending number. Remember to include new expenses you'll have in retirement, too. Trust me, you'll want to travel and enjoy your newfound freedom. Now, here comes our trusted dividend formula. Take your estimated annual spending, let's say $80,000 just for example purposes, and divide it by the dividend yield of the stocks you'll own, likely around 3-4%. to This will tell us the portfolio size needed to cover your full income needs. In this example, $80,000 annual spend divided by 3.5% dividend yield equals a $2.3 million portfolio. Seem like a lot? Maybe, but it's totally doable if you start early and invest consistently while you work. Through the magic of compound growth, even $500 monthly over 30 years could get you there. But of course, we want to fast-track dividend income, as the title promises. 
So let's get to those high yield dividend aristocrat stocks and funds so you can reach your goals ASAP. Three fastest ways to live off dividends. All right, dividend lovers, you've made it to the main event. We're going to cover three of my absolute favorite fast track strategies to have your dividend stocks pay 100% of your living expenses. High yield dividend ETFs. Coming in hot at our number three spot is a dividend all-star category called High Yield Dividend ETFs. For those newer to investing, ETF stands for Exchange Traded Fund, which is essentially a basket of stocks and bonds within a theme that you can buy and sell on the stock market. Here's the key advantage. ETFs provide instant diversification instead of relying on just a handful of stocks. And these high yield varieties focus specifically on assets paying juicy 5 to 6 to 7 percent plus dividends. Examples include funds like SCHD, VYM, and NOBL. Not only are dividend yields impressive, but the funds also hold dozens of stable blue chip dividend stocks across various sectors. This helps reduce risk compared to picking individual stocks yourself as a newbie. Plus, many brokerages even let you enroll in programs to automatically reinvest your dividends, meaning your dividend income can start compounding exponentially over time. For instance, let's say you invested $300,000 into a high-yield ETF averaging 5% dividends. That would kick out around $15,000 in your first year. But as you reinvest those dividends to buy more shares, your payments would quickly ramp up over the years ahead. In less than 10 years, at a modest 6% annual growth rate, your account could swell to nearly $600,000, throwing off $30,000 plus dollars yearly. And the numbers only get more exciting from there, all while you relax and let the money work for you. How's that for passive income? Covered Call ETFs If high dividend yields really rev your engine, you'll love our next category, Covered Call ETFs. These specialty funds combine dividends with income from selling options contracts. I won't clutter your brain explaining options just yet. For now, Know that they allow these funds to generate 8 to 15% plus dividend yields. Prime examples are funds like XYLD, QYLD, RYLD, and more. Of course, there's some additional complexity with these beyond traditional dividend funds. But for our dividend hunters looking to fast track income growth early on, covered call funds can be a financially savvy move. With $300,000 invested at a 10% average yield, we're now talking $3,000 plus of dividends in year one. And if you set up dividend reinvestment like before, your income stream and total portfolio value would really start to snowball over time. Just imagine how fast you could reach your personal income goal if starting out with yields this high. Individual Dividend Aristocrat Stocks Last but not least is constructing your own portfolio of individual dividend aristocrat stocks. As a reminder, dividend aristocrats are those consistent dividend raisers I mentioned earlier that share profits with investors year after year after year. Some aristocrat examples include AT&T, Coca-Cola, Johnson & Johnson, and Procter & Gamble. Can you think of any products you use from those household names? I'm willing to bet you can. Building your own custom portfolio of companies with indispensable products and unrivaled dividend histories can set you up perfectly to live off dividends. While aristocrats' yields generally sit around 2-4%, to the sky-high safety and reliability make them cornerstone income holdings. Sure, you can amplify and speed up your dividend earnings with those previous ETF tricks we've discussed. But establishing a solid base of blue chip dividend aristocrats should provide peace of mind that your income stream is built to last. And if you combine both low and higher yielding holdings, you'll have a well balanced portfolio across stability, growth, and income generation to accomplish your goals even faster. There you have it, my friends the three fastest ways you can realistically collect 3,200, 4,000, or more monthly to live off dividends alone. I can't wait for you to put these powerful strategies to work so you can someday trade in the 9 to 5 grind for financial freedom. But before you go, please take a minute to like this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. 
Your support really means a lot and helps spread the word so more people can start living off dividends. Also, let me know in the comments what dividend strategy sounds most appealing to you right now and any other dividend investing questions you might have. I love connecting with the community. Now go leverage these high yield assets to get that perpetual passive income stream flowing as fast as possible. I can't wait to hear your dividend freedom success stories soon.